being a host, like I feel like I'm entering my host era. Not even feel, I am entering my host in era. Good morning guys, happy Sunday. So today is my reset day. So guys, last year me and my husband hosted our first like couple getaway. That's one of our goals of the year. Um, we wanted to start up a new tradition with our friends. You know, we kind of do a lot of like hanging out with our friend at home and stuff, but we wanted to do something away. And that was the first one and it was quite successful. I'm going to kind of link um, but not kind of I'm going to link the videos of the trip within this video so I deleted the whole first day uh, of the content by mistake um, don't like I don't even want to even think about it so um, when we got there like the first day we got there which was like basically half a day all of the recording from that day is gone like footage or deleted I'm just like you know what we're not gonna bust about this we're just gonna move on and like do whatever is best um so we got there on what was it a friday yeah we got at the trip on um thursday evening normally i swear in my face with my bra this is so in my stove so i'm gonna be it's like well i'm not gonna link it it's i really link in my store so if you just go to my bio my store is linked there it's also like separated from my like, skincare to hair care to clothing, you know, fitness clothing and all that good stuff. So make sure to adventure while you're on my website. But anyway, let's get started. We start with my brush and this is my black soap. Um, there's a turmeric black soap. I sell this on my website as well. This is what I use for just like cleaning my face. So let's do that. I started like slowly buzzing my face in. Yeah, with the black soap, turmeric scrub. I mean, um, soap, I'm saying scrub. Just wanna slowly buzz in your face. So yeah, so we um we decided on Colorado. Once I said I wanted something cool and chill in. So he was like, yeah, Colorado will make more sense because it's gonna be snowing the time that we had decided on. We were deciding on either November or December. And he was like, yeah, um, Colorado makes a lot of sense. This is part of um, reaching out to my friends and just kind of telling them what um, we are going to, where we're going and how much each person got to pay and all that stuff. Our friends are very proactive, like they're very quick with stuff. So it makes life so much easier. Once we decided Colorado was the area, we were like, perfect. Now let's look for Airbnb. I started to look for Airbnbs in Colorado and I wanted something private. I wanted something away from um, people. I didn't want too many people around where we can have the night peacefully, if that makes sense. Because my friends, we are all competitive people. And when we play games, we go off. So I was just like, you know what? Let's find something a little deeper. Um, so I started to look on Airbnb. I found a few cabins. Uh, one of the cabins stood out to me. I think I told you guys, uh, like a month ago when I was doing one of my videos I was like I was doing a hair video and I had shown you guys the cabin at that time I already found the cabin I was still looking but I was just like like I have already predetermined <laughs> I've already predetermined that that was the location that we'll be staying at because it was just perfect I felt like there was nothing else I could find that was better than that it was quite easy I sent it in the group chat and I did a poll I'm like guys um let me know which cabin you guys would like to go to. I'm Wendy. So I reach out to my girls and I go, hey y'all. And all of my girls have a partner. A uh, majority of my girls have a partner. So the ones that have a partner, because this was specifically for couples. So I reach out to my, my couple's friends and I go, hey y'all. Um, uh, Iris and I are planning a couple's trip. Um, and we want you guys to come. And they were all, <laughs> they were all in from the beginning. Like the moment I told them about it, they were all like, yes, yes. So that was even perfect. Like nobody was like, oh, strip. 
again another thing i would like to say is that um i didn't want my i didn't want my friends overly paying for this first trip i just wanted them to also kind of get the experience of what the trip was about which is about getting you and your partner together you know tuning out everything in the world and just kind of just vibing with each other which is exactly what happened everyone everyone came together not all of my friends know each other so i have different sets and uh, group of friends i have my new york uh, set of friends i'm from new york um that's where i went to high school that's where i met my husband while we we're in college so you know i have my new york set of friends um uh, i think not two one of them are here in texas they are actually no two of my new york set of friends are actually in texas they are living with their partners here so it was even perfect with planning because that's why they were able to like travel together and drove together um but yeah so they didn't know each other so like my other couple friends who have been married for a longer time they didn't know the rest of the crew but i did have friends give it and invited the other ones kind of just to mix them together and see how they would vibe together let me tell you something i just i have this i have this feeling like you know just all of my friends have similar characteristic as you know as me and they all just vibe together i just love how they just mix up and everything just comes out so right you know being a host like i feel like i'm entering my host era not even feel i am entering my host and era i enjoy host so pick up the grocery we picked up everything we needed for cooking like i wanted to i was planning on making goat pepper soup so i actually packed the goat with me when i was going on the flight i had saran wrap and kept it in a in one of those cooling um system that they sell I packed it in the luggage and it was still frozen when we got to the the Airbnb. It was still frozen. I'm like, I just love those. They do the job. But anyway, pick up groceries, got to the Airbnb. It was like five something when we got to the Airbnb. It was almost six o'clock. Let me tell y'all, it was dark. I was just like, why is it so dark? You know, I haven't really gotten a full glance of how, you know, the whole change of time, you know, in the year affects everybody like when it gets dark like that so easily i'm just like i'm so depressed i like summer i think everybody can testify that summer is the best time of the year mm -hmm. or spring even spring is good too but anyway and fall but anyway so we got to the airbnb the girls helped me pack everything in the thing and the guys brought all of the luggage out i just love the dynamic of the friend group like they all didn't like not knowing each other they were all just working together it just felt so good and felt so right and i felt so grateful to even have that set of group i mean that set of um friends and the mindset that it carried um they worked together nobody was complaining there was not a single soul complaining about what was needed to be done if something needs to be done somebody's gonna do it and got there the girls helped me we pack and the uh, food in the in the large ass fridge that fridge held everything perfect i've been making like dinner for the night i made some mashed potatoes and um chicken and like i think it's very good asparagus or spinach one of those vegetables spinach so yeah i made those and by the time they were all like done showering and freshening up the food was basically almost done and i gave us time because i flew the, the chicken in the oven to fully cook i had grilly i had you know brown them on the pot and then i put it in the oven because i wanted it to be well cooked so we put that in the oven and then iris and i went and we got a shower and we came down and then i served the food for everybody so the food was still warm because everything just came out the oven so that's that that was the basically the end of the day one and then after that we ended up when things started to go really nice and amazing so i'm gonna insert the whole video here for you guys to continue and enjoy this beautiful event we had and i hope this is something you can plan for you and your close friends and i'm telling you it will be enjoyable one like the first time throw away all my pride don't want to say i love you first but holding it in 
in just might make me burst Love in the open Daydreaming, hoping Melting in our make-believe new worlds Whispering winds bring the remembrance That you're my girl
crazy last night. I am so tempted to go out there, but it's still the way. And my voice is all gone. So Steven, got burned during the clean. Let's go take a trip in the colon. In the colon. Holy crap. It's not that bad. Ooh. It's actually not that bad when your body is, you know, body temperature. But this is so beautiful. Oh my god. It's like winter wonderland. And it's funny because that's what the trip, that's what we named this year trip as. Forgive my voice because y'all last night we were playing some couple games and basically everybody lost their voice because we are so competitive and stuff. <sighs> the temperature, I was expecting to get really cold. I don't feel as cold. <laughs> what is cold? Did you hear that? That's the snow on floor. I'm glad I brought these because Lord, this is perfect. Wow. This is so beautiful. I'm just looking from here. Whispering wind 
up my power yes afraid to lose each other counting the hours till i see you again again could you be life lover and best friend waiting for text back wondering where Butterflies flapping in me Don't stop what you're doing yeah. What you doing? Da-da-da-da <laughs> <laughs> like the first time throw away all my pride don't want to say I, I love you first but holding it in just might make me burst love in the
scared. Uh, he's bald. He's in sports. Um, what No, no, no. Another sport. No, no. Football. Football. Basketball. 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 Basketball.
butterflies flapping in me don't stop what you do like the first time throw away all my pride don't want to say I, I love you first holding it in just might make me burst love in the open daydreaming hoping melting in Whispering winds bring the remembrance that you're my girl. No shame, no gaze. I wanna fall in love, fall in love. I'll be a savage, I'll be a baddest bitch, or do you? Caramel honey dipped I'm yours till the eclipse Don't let it slip Give up my power Yes, I'm afraid to lose each other Counting the hours till I see you again, again. Could you be life lover and best friend? Waiting for text back Wondering where you went Or who could you be with No, I'm not possessive But you're mine I'ma let you live, no shame Butterflies flapping in me, don't stop what you're doing, yeah, what you're doing. <laughs> da -da -da -da. Feels like the first time Throw away all my pride Don't wanna say I, I love you first But holding it in just might make me burst Love in the open Daydreaming hoping Melting in heart Leave new worlds Whispering winds Bring the remembrance That you're my girl No shame No games I wanna fall In love Fall In love I'll be a savage I'll be a bad or do you like sweet caramel honey dipped? I'm yours till the beat flips. Don't let it slip. Give up.
up my power Yes, afraid to lose each other Counting the hours till I see you again Could you be life lover and best friend Waiting for text back Wondering where like the first time throw away all my pride don't want to say I, I love you first but holding it in just might make me burst love in the so much Da 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 da
Mm. Are we gonna wear it? One advice you would give couples who are looking for loving, meaningful relationship like you and he have? Uh, to... Be your husband. I need one for both of you. Oh, hold on. Not her drinking soup, finally. <laughs> you got Brian nervous now. You don't even know what he's going to say. You got him nervous. Brian don't get nervous. Brian don't get nervous. <laughs> I knew that was coming too. I knew that was coming. So, what is one advice from each of y'all? I would say to never forget to have fun. I love that. To always remain friends. 
patience. Oh. <laughs> you know, to always have soup. To always have soup. True. But, but soup. to always uh, feed your partner. Uh, no, but um, <laughs> she always had to get good with it. Like you said the other day, um, being too forgiving people, you know, willing to forgive, willing right. to resolve conflict in a respectable manner. Um, and, and like I said, have fun. Keep the spark, date nights, and things intimacy. Right. Um, the things that make your relationship thrive right. are the things that keep it going. Mm. And just remember that love is also a word, an emotion, and an action. I love that. Thank you. <laughs> you have make our hearts soft. <laughs> I just need one. So I need you guys to give us one good thing, or one good advice you can give to couples out there. You know, something that makes your relationship, you know, better. I think it would be respect and patience. Right. Because without that, nothing grows. Right. Grace. <laughs> Grace is like thinking about it. Listen to your partner and always understand. Oh, I love it. <laughs> I love it. So, one piece of advice that you would give any couple to keep their relationship strong. Ladies first, I'm respectful doing it. Well, I'll go first. Um, you have to learn your partner. You know, like you guys are going to be together forever, I assumed. Um, so you want to learn their ins and outs. You know, how to love them, how to understand them. I think everyone has um, different ways of understanding each other. And I think you have to find out what your partner is. And then figure that out. And another thing is, always love each other and show love all the time. All the time. And be nice when you speak to your partner. Always be kind. I feel like I'm giving a lot. But be kind. Speak with gentle and love. Always. 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 Beautiful. I think um, I'm going to have to go with what you said. You have to be quick to forgive. Hmm? I think very quick to forgive, quick to listen. Right, and quick to understand. Right? Mm -hmm. You have to look, you have to seek to understand. These are all skills that you have to actively try to develop. Mm -hmm. Right, and it's not something that people actively try to develop. And like any skill, it takes time. And like he said, you have to be patient because over time, you, you, think, you, know, you get better at doing all those things, especially with your partner. Because like she said, you get to know them more, you get to know their ins and outs, what triggers them. Um, what makes them happy, and I think you, you know you work to each other's strengths, not each other's weaknesses. Mm -hmm. You work to mitigate weaknesses and work and play towards each other's strengths, and I think that's um, what makes a relationship strong. Love it, beautiful, beautiful. <laughs> Life lover and best friend, best friend. Wait
info takes back Wondering where you at Or who could you be with No, I'm not possessive But you're mine okay. I'ma let you live, no shame What's up, guys? I don't know if you guys can hear us. Oh my God, I'm lost. They can't hear us. But we are back home. I'm ready to sleep. I'm hungry. I'm praying we're gonna get tonight. I'm already dug on, but what I'm gonna eat later. That's how you know I'm ready to eat. I'm very close. Awesome. I can hear you. There you go. Well, guys, um, this is an amazing trip. Are we gonna check in with you guys? We might be able to check in with you guys later. Um, we're waiting on our Uber to get here. Uh, yeah. You look good. Look at you. I do. She's so. <laughs> right. Anyway, y'all, yeah, we'll see you guys later. Uber's this is here. this was the end of the trip. You know, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Tell us what you love about this trip and what's your Albert. Anyway, yeah. Thank you. Feels like the first time. Throw away all my pride. Don't want to say I, I love you first. But holding it in just might make me burst. Love in the open. Daydreaming, hoping, melting in our make-believe new worlds, whispering wind.